wind blow is mm-hmm. she's gonna be in tune. So if you don't deal with like ass play like that, what about like urine? Yeah. Like I love that. Like urine as far as like I let you piss in my mouth, then I come kiss you. I love for a woman to piss in my mouth. No, like you piss in my mouth and then I come and tongue kiss you afterwards. I never had that done. Oh, but okay. I love for a woman to piss in my mouth. That's beautiful. You never had that one done either? What? A woman pissing in your mouth. Yeah, I done yeah. had a woman pee in a cup while we was driving and I drunk it. Oh, okay. Right, Period. right there. Yes. Because it was just nothing. I was so infatuated with this woman to where it was just nothing about her that was nasty. Like, mm. And then she's super clean. She like me. She drank number water all day. So her piss ain't got no taste. Right. Like, and you know they said that's how you survive too. Like if you're in a desert somewhere and need something to drink, you're just supposed to drink your urine. I haven't been in the desert and needed to well, survive. Well, <laughs> I saw I something. Wouldn't know. Like, I, saw- <laughs> I know, but I'm a big skeptic. Like yeah. everything that I tell you, I'm going to speak from a standpoint of Yeah. Experience. Well, I saw it on like a movie. Yeah. That's- and I didn't know that though watching a movie and they had nothing to drink and she yeah, had to pee to that's, her chair. That's a movie. But I'm yeah. talking about like anything no, I tell you going to yes. be something that I personally experienced. Yeah. I am a big skeptic. Mm-hmm. Like I'm super. I'm I'm a super big skeptic. Like I gotta see for myself. Or right? Can you show me or demonstrate it in front of me? Or mm-hmm. that's just the person I am. I don't try to be like this, but I always been like that since a child. Like I, I want to see. I ask questions. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So have you ever had? Have you ever nutted up a female's nose and she coughed it out and spit it back on your dick and sucked it some more? No, I haven't had that experience. Oh, okay, y'all. We're trying to see what he haven't done, y'all. And I'm trying to see what he has done. It's not that. It's not that. I just, I haven't had that experience. You haven't had that experience. Um. Okay, so how many people have you had sex with at one time? Like, how many? Like, more than one? Like, the most? Like, in the bedroom? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. So, you've had a threesome before, I'm it's assuming. Not- yeah, so... You can't tell me. So it's been a lot, maybe? No, ma'am. Time? I have been to like a, um, God, she going to kill me for saying this. <laughs> I had went to a, um, a swingers resort. Mm-hmm. And it was like a, like an orgy. Mm-hmm. But I didn't participate in it. It was just beautiful being in the environment. Like watching. everybody being naked, everybody mm-hmm. being free. Mm-hmm. And it was just beautiful being in the environment. But you didn't partake in it. No, we did this other thing where they had fluffers come in and fluff us. Like a fluffer is the person that prep you, that yeah. get the woman with, get yeah. the man yeah. erect before you have sex with your partner. Mm-hmm. I done had something like that go on. What? Okay, so, hmm. Okay, so, do you like submissive women? Mm. Or do you like dominant women? It depends, cause I didn't met some of the most sexually dominant women that were submissive with me. Yes, because and, it's you. And, and and I asked them why, and they say because it's the energy it's that the energy. you exude. Mm-hmm. And I was like, "What you mean?" And a lot of women tell me that your energy is not. Mm-hmm. It's almost like it's not human. I done had them tell me it was God. Like, I done had them tell me it was, like, animalistic, like right. a creature. Like, right. Like, majestic, like a lion or something. Mm-hmm. I done had women tell me that. Right. But. I always tell people, too, like, um, a woman will submit to a certain man. It's the energy of, you know, how he comes off. Well, and- I, I, go- I govern. Hmm? I govern with, I'm a govern a woman. Mm-hmm. With power, class, and authority. I'm mm-hmm. not going to... I'm here to protect you. Like, if if I'm with a woman, I'm here to protect you. Like, me and my woman, we have arguments sometimes about her going to that door, opening that door. Like, I'm going to open the door for you. Mm-hmm. I told you, you don't touch no door handles. And that's just, even on May Day, I'm still going to open the door for you because that's just how I was taught. A woman don't touch no door handles around me. And we had like, oh, well, babe, I'm sorry. I'm just used to doing it by myself. Mm-hmm. I understand that. Mm-hmm. But I need you to understand that this is not how that's going. I'm going to open the door for you. You don't go out the door in front of me. I'm here to protect you. What? And so, so I have that problem because I guess I'll just be gone. So I that definitely just come from That just comes from you exhibiting a level of independence. Yeah. You know, you haven't 
had anybody preside over you or govern you. Right. And I hate to say it with that term, but I just feel like a man supposed to protect a woman. It's right. just how I feel. Right. Okay. Um, okay, so I don't know if anyone ever asked you this before. I'm not, I'm not sure, but do you watch porn? No, ma'am. Have you ever watched porn? I used to. Did you have a certain type of porn you would watch? 